Hey guys, Quinn here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to create a Zoiper soft phone account using the extension information that we can provide you here at OneWire. Now, Zoiper is a free soft phone application that we like to use here. Uh, there are many soft phone applications, some that are free, others that aren't, that you may find you want to use. Setting them up will be similar. To get started, you're going to want to go ahead and search for Zoiper. So either open a browser or a new tab, and we're just going to type in Zoiper. And we're looking for the newest download. I believe that's Zoiper 3 as of October 4th, 2016 today. And it's going to pull us into a page that looks similar to this. And Zoiper is going to ask us for our operating system. And here we're using Windows, so we're going to leave that clicked. And we're going to hit Next. Now, there are three options here. We want to use the free option. If you are interested in, in other features, you can choose this business option that does cost. Um, but for our purposes today we're going to choose the free option and that should start an automatic download uh, here in Google Chrome that's going to populate down here in the bottom if you're using another browser you may have to search in your downloads for that installation wizard um, since we've already got that here on this computer I'm going to go ahead and pull it up you're going to want to follow the prompts in your installation there until you have the application installed once you do this black box is going to show up um, this is the basic home page for Zoiper uh, and this is where we're going to create an account so you're going to come up to this top option here settings and that will drop down to several options we want to choose create a new account from here we're going to uh, select the SIP option or SIP and hit next now this is where you're going to input the information that you will get from us here at OneWire this is your extension information you will also use this information for other applications such as the click to dial. Um, you can find links to those other videos in the comments below. Um, also check out our YouTube page uh, for additional tutorials. But here is where I'm going to put my extension 9013 and the password that we'll provide you. And finally, the domain or where your PBX or phone system resides. In this case, we're using OneWire. And we're going to either hit uh, Enter or Next. And that's going to show us this account name that should be your extension at your domain. Do not click the Skip Auto Detection. We're going to come right on down and hit the Next button. That's going to let us know that our account has been added to the list. You can add more accounts and register additional extensions, but in this case we're going to go ahead and hit close. Now to verify that our extension is in fact added and good to go, you can come up back to the settings option here, drop down, and select the preferences option. Now you're going to see over here your extension at your domain with this little green check mark next to it. That shows that your extension is ready to go. Now, by any click, uh, by one click, you can either unregister or re-register that extension if you don't want to receive or make phone calls uh, at any particular time without removing the account completely. To remove the account, again, you'll just highlight that option and come on down to this remove account option. In this case, we're verified that this is ready to go, and we're going to go ahead and hit the green check mark OK. Now your soft phone uh, will make and receive calls as though you were at your physical desk phone. Uh, if you're using a desktop, um, be sure that your speakers are turned up so that you can hear the calls coming in. Also, you will need an external microphone to plug in if your computer does not already have one. Um, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and check out more of our tutorials to see how you can get the most out of your phone system.